Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... Oh, shit. I don't want to live anymore. <laughs> Oh my god. F finally kill Yogi. I've been hunting this guy for so long, bro. Damn. I've been hunting this guy for like two hours. Hunting this guy for like two hours. Oh my goodness, bro. Oh my, oh my god, that's a lot. Legendary Bear Claw, Animal Fat, Dead Eye. Damn, bro. Damn. <laughs> Did a lot for this damn thing right here. Now they're telling me to bring it to Trapper. I don't, I don't really know who he is, but. So this, this bear right here, this is bear fur also, but this is not the legendary bear fur on, on top of the horse. I thought I thought it was him, but it was like a small black bear. But I, you know, I still have to take him out for practice. Uh, but yeah, let me uh, let me replace the black bear pelt with the legendary. With the legendary. Damn. Okay, boy. Hold on, let me see something. Is is there something I could do with the with the rest of it? I, I'm pretty sure I can't pick it up. Yeah, I'm not picking that up. Damn, I feel so accomplished, bro, <laughs> for doing that. It took me so long to find him and then to to kill him. Ah, oh, man. Damn, that's a victory right there, man. I'm going to take him to town and... Yeah, I'm, I'm going to take him to town and, and see what's up. What can, I, what can I get for him? They said bring it to the trapper, so I'm going to see what's up with that. Damn, look at my back. Oh, man. I'll see y'all at the trapper. This looks like the trapper. It was good, man. Alright. Hey, you're my man. My friend, uh, Hosea, he told me that I could come to you. Ferrati met his match at last, huh? My congratulations. This is the trapper. He buys whole animals, skin furs, hides, and feathers. He can also craft various clothing items, an animal, and pelts you sell him. Okay. Alright, boy, what can you do for me, man? Hold on, before I even do that, let me look around real quick. What you what you got around here? Alright, you know, let me 
Let me talk to you first. Get this out the way. Aim weapon. Buy. You seem the ambitious type. If you want a unique garment, you need to bring me a unique belt. It'll be worth it. Okay. All made to measure. Okay. Alright, garment sets. What you got? The beer hunter. Okay, so if I want to get this beer hunter, you do not own this item? The beer hunter. I know I don't own it. Okay, so I need a legendary beer head hat. I can make a hat. Any benefits from wearing this hat? Slightly warm. Pair with other warm items for protection from the cold. Okay. The recipe is one legend. Okay, I got the legendary beer pal. What's what? going on here? You got trouble in tow? What happened? Ah. Uh, Damn it, you make yourself scarce right now. Are you serious? Ah, uh, the bounty guys, they coming after me. Damn. I got a dip. I got a dip. Oh man. Go find a charm school. Oh relax. Okay, boy. Since then, let's go listen to the child. Yeah. Store that can be found in the bonus. Alright, so I'm gonna be back. Oh! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me? Get up. Get up. We are not gonna die and lose this pelt. We are not we are not losing this pelt. Get up. We are not losing this pelt. We're not losing this pelt. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, Alright, looks like we're good. You know, I had to leave the area for a little bit. But, um, it looks like the people that were hunting me down, looks like they disappeared. All right, let me try and uh, do some quick shopping. Oh, I know those scars anywhere. Yeah, Looks I know. like Barati met his match at last, huh? So I can't get the whole outfit because I don't have... I don't have the perfect bison and all that extra stuff. But you know what? The hat is the dopest looking thing here yeah, anywhere. It's the one that stands out the most. So I'm just going to get the hat. Um, how do I buy it? Uh, X to craft. All right, cool, just like that. All right. Hey, what is this? You trailing trouble? Uh oh. Trying to annoy me, friend. Shining example of American manners. All right, so I got some people coming after me. So we we out. Uh, we on the move again. Yeah. All right, let's let's keep it moving. All right, guys. So I'm about to go. You remember the, remember how I read that letter back at the camp? It was like a lady. Her name was uh, I, I, I forgot what her name was. I think it was like Marie or Marley or something. What, what her name was? Uh, let's see, Mary Linton. Mary Linton. So we're, we're gonna go see what she what she talking about. She told me how she needed some help or something. It sounded like she was like an old flame or something like. My man Arthur was messing with that in the past or something. So I don't know. We're gonna see what she about. So let me uh, let me uh, remove my uh, yeah, re remove the mask. You know what I mean? I look kind of wild with this horse. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, not that horse with this um, this bear on my face. <laughs> I look kind of wild, bro. But it was well earned, man. <laughs> she was well earned. Um, let's see, where can I put him down? Ah, screw it, just leave him like that. Let's see if she home. Did I just knock on the door? Okay. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Um, uh, is, um... Uh... Is Mrs. Linton in? 
I'll go see. Mrs. Lemon, a collar for you. I look wild at Hello, Arthur. Mary. Um. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, ah, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart? Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the... Nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? I'll help just to see what's going on. Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. My name ain't Arthur. My, my name is Yogi. That's my name now, Yogi. Hey, boo-boo. Want to go save Jamie's ass again? Let's go, boy. <laughs> oh, you got you got food over here, girl? You got food over here? Hold up. Hold up, shorty got food over here. Hold up. Hold up. Let me get this food real quick. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Let me get, let me, let me get this food real quick, man. Hold up. Hold up. He got up like, yo, what the? Oh, this don't look right, y'all. I'm out. All right, so we, now that we identified him. That's all. Let me just get that food real quick, man. I might as well get this free food. Hold up, close this gate real quick. Nah, nobody coming out. No, nah, nobody coming out. Oh, he like, I'm out of here, y'all. He like, I'm out of here. <laughs> he said, I'm out. <laughs> they bounce on your boy. <laughs> hey, bro, I'm just... I'm just trying to get this, you know, get this cloth. Try to make me some Yeezys.
died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Uh. Yeah, sure. Hop on. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. You know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? Sure. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool, always complaining. But does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Yeah. Gee, thanks. <laughs> <coughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch, then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? Yeah. Oh, we're getting close now. Yeah, I'm assuming it's right up here, up this hill. Damn, girl, you took me all the way out of my way. I thought you was closer than this. <laughs> if I knew you was this far, I would have told your ass no. <laughs> Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way of thanking you. All right. <laughs> Appreciate it. <sighs> yeah, yeah. What a lousy day. She left her horse dead on the floor. She probably not even gonna go back and get him. All right, back to the mission, man. Okay, looks like we're close by. Whoa, 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 whoa. That looks like it over there. What the hell are they doing? Is this the, the religious people? Oh, where are they going? Why are they just running like that? Where are they going? I don't know. Some doesn't make sense. Hold on, let me pull up, pull out my, my, you know, I could, I could wield both at the same time. That's yep. pretty dope. Easy now. What's going on over here? This is what is un, is unavailable due to your recent crimes. <laughs> what crimes did I do? Turn at a later time. What crimes are they talking about? I I just pulled up. So I went and took a took like a nap. Actually, no, I slept for like 18 hours. <laughs> um, that way, the day could go by faster, so I could come back. So now I'm back. Hopefully, they don't get scared off like last time. Hold up, just make sure I got my weapon. All right, cool. 
Oh shit, sure. I'm missing some weapons. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Chelonia? Sounds like they're chanting right now. Hold up. I wish they always let me just walk around with my weapons. They're having to go back to my horse. Like, sometimes I forget, and then I'll go deep into an area where I need a battle. And then I don't have my weapons. It's like, come on. You know what I mean? I'm always gonna want my weapons. I'm, I'm always gonna want all of my weapons. Yeah. You know I mean? All right, what's going on over here? And what is Chelonians? No less than the recent rediscovery of theology. <laughs> One hundred years ago, the great. Chelonian master led pilgrims across the Lanahassi into the wilderness to found a great place of safety. A place of safety. So. That is where we are heading, Jamie. Yes, Jamie. That is where we are heading. Yes, Jamie. We are heading to paradise. It is a mountain. It sounds wonderful. It is wonderful, Jamie. Really. Wonderful. My father, your father, will understand, Jamie. It's a paradise. It's in the mountains. The hell? When we get there, Jamie. We will write to your father together. Together from the mountains. Yo. <laughs> Shalonia. Shalonia. This is like some cult type Shalonia. of stuff. Yeah, th this reminds me of Far Cry 5, because... Do, do I gotta come and break it up now, or...? Alright, I guess I'm just gonna walk up over here and just... Shell of safety? <laughs> What's, go What's going on, guys? I'm just here for Jamie. Not nothing crazy. Uh, now, which one of y'all is Jamie? You guys put. Shell of safety. Shell uh, of safety. Gotta speak to the boy. Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? What path has I chosen? Incited? Impatient. I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Dut, dut. <laughs> Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? Yes, I am. Only when dealing with idiots. Now let me talk to the boy. Bruh, I'm not. Move out of my way. Shell of safety? Okay. God damn. Lunatic. <laughs> I'm not getting through you now. <laughs> That's enough, Arthur. Kid, come on. This is crap. You're better than this. Better than what? Better than one in paradise? Better than thinking these fools know a damn thing about paradise. Now let me take you home. You're a sad man, Arthur. You're a real sad man. Sure, but come home. No, not a chance! All right, so now I gotta... Leave All right, it. hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Where, 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 you, where you going? Oh my God. Now I gotta chase him down. <laughs> uh, come on, Jamie. Now nah, you right. You right. It ain't none of my business. It's your sister's business. I'm just trying to get out of this business. Oh. They're just using you. Telling you what you want to hear. What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? Hey, what kind of horse you got, bro? That shit moving. Just stop and let's talk about this. You pop up out of nowhere? Yeah. Now nah, you right. I popped up out of nowhere. 
Bruh, I'm about to punch you in your face as soon as I get to you. Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I was doing just fine by myself. I mean, it looked like they was about to kill you, bruh. That's what it looked like. It looked like they was about to have you drink some poison or something. Jamie, my horse is getting tired, bro. Yeah. Damn it, we gotta do this the hard way. I don't have to answer to you. Oh my god. Damn it, what are you feeding your horse, bro? Sorry, mister. What are you gonna do, Jamie? Live the rest of your life in the mountains with those people? They're my friends. Oh my god, he's too. Don't leave me alone, I'll shoot you. I swear it. What are you talking about? You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. Yeah. Oh, word? Okay. What are you doing? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta feed my horse. I gotta feed my horse. Easy. Oh, shit. Oh. I'm a man now. I, I found something. A calling. You're just a kid. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. You leave me alone. They're good people. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> leave me alone. Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... Oh, shit. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Oh, shit. Slowly press R2 to fill the meter. Okay. The more full... Okay. Oh! What happened? <laughs> Wait, what just happened? I don't, how he died? I shot him in the hand. Hold up, hold up. Uh, retry. Checkpoint. <laughs> I don't know what the hell just happened. I shot him in the hand. How did he die? I warned you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Okay. I guess I got to, like, first fill the meter lightly. And then fully press R2. And then shoot the gun out of Jamie's hand. Now calm down. Let's go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> Just like that. Okay. <laughs> okay, kid. Damn. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long uh, time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you. Didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia, though. Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. All Father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, 
but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father, nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. <laughs> Thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, well, um... Here we are. She must be waiting inside. I, I was actually interested in hearing the rest of that conversation, but I guess I got too close. Yeah, my horse looked tired, son. He have his head down. Make it quick or I might run off again. Ah, shut up. You feed my horse, bro. My horse come before you, bro. Come on, eat up. There you go. There you go, Toyota. That's how you that's how you do it. That's how you look now. Look at look at all good now. His head is up. We going in then? Yeah, we going in, bro. Get off my damn horse. To put my Toyota, you know, put the security on. You're nervous about seeing her, aren't you? Jamie, Jamie, come home, please. You've Father's been very sad. Your father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. Did I refuse to shake a hand? Uh, I don't get it. Oh, okay. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but... Somehow, I imagine I shall. Ooh, we loved once and true. Why would you ever leave the house looking like that? Boy, if I have a bounty on my head, bro. Give a fellow a nickel. All right, y'all. <laughs> I'm going to catch you on the next episode, man. It's getting real, so I feel like he's going to want to go after her. Maybe that'll give me a little bit more backstory as to what happened before all this shit happened. So I'm going to catch you on next. Nah, ain't nobody got no damn heart, bro. I'll right, catch you on the next episode. Peace.